already detention. Please welcome Officer Ruska, who's here to give you a very special and very mandatory talk about drugs. Thank you, Ms. Ron. All right, class, school year's wrapping up. You got summer ahead of you, full of possibilities, like avoiding work and getting teen pregnant. That's why I'm here today to give you the hard facts about hard drugs. Now, hands up. How many of you have done the marijuana? None of you. Interesting, because recent studies show that 11 out of 10 high school students have tried the Doobie Mac before grade 12. Mr. Ruska? Officer. 11 out of 10 isn't a thing. Now, some of you may not believe this study. I didn't at first, partially due to its sizable margin of error. But the study's not what's important. What's important is drug education. The fact is, more and more places are legalizing them dank nugs. And as we all know, the green stinkweed is a gateway drug. Come on. Oh, sure. That's the reaction I usually get. But the fact is, if you take even one hit of the Mary Jams, you will smoke meth and die. What? Ah, you've heard of meth, have you? Crystal? Ice? Brian Cranston? Well, maybe you know it by some of its other street names, too? Hawaiian Punch? Earth, Wind, and Ice? Meth Busters? The Crystalline Entity? The Methly Hollows? Rocks? Riggedy Rocks? The School of Hard Rocks? The Crystal Method featuring Fatboy Slim? The Methder Mash? I don't think those are real. Oh, so you're the expert now. No, but... Well, son, when your ears have fallen off and you have hair growing out of your teeth because you thought it'd be okay to smoke a meth or two, then you tell me if it's real. Which brings me to cocaine. Cocaine. China white. Thailand white. Burma white. Burma shave. A cup of icing sugar. The white knight that knocks twice. Speed. Wait, that's a different... Speed two. Cruise control. Coke. Cack. Gack. Kathwack. Nose candy, happy nose times, the nostril avenger, sinus slam, goodbye septum. I'm pretty sure these aren't real now. I haven't heard of any of them. Oh, another expert junior grade drug dealer, are you? You know every drug because you've got an entire catalog of them coursing through your body? Huh? There's no place in your world for any new street names? Hmm? No, but... No, because you're not out there on all fours every day fighting this war on drugs. On all fours? To fight the drugs, I have to get close to the streets. How else am I going to stop all those syringes of ecstasy from being smuggled into your school? Ecstasy? Really? Oh, I'm sorry. I guess Miss Ran and I are the only ones here who know it by that name. What? No. But maybe you've heard of King Size Pillow Top? The Cocoon Devil? Farquhar Cat Prince? Okay, you must have made that one up. You can't make up the streets. That doesn't make sense. That's another street name for ecstasy. What, you can't make up the streets? Yes, it's hyphenated. Uh, Miss Ron? Pay attention. You don't get it, do you? You're knee deep in Lutes, Barbs, Debbies, Horsey Party Time, Magic Fungus, Moby Nash, Blue Nose Schooner, Secretariat, mm -hmm. Throm. That wasn't even a real word. You think they don't have drugs outside of North America? You racist. And that's not all. PCP, CFCs, ABCs, CBGBs, what? How many of these drugs have you done yourself? When, today? Miss Ron? Nope. So, what did you learn today, my future crackheads of America? Oh, hey, that's a real drug. It's the realest drug out there, and it'll kill you. They'll all kill you, so don't do them, or I will. Uh, you'll do the drugs or you'll kill us? Miss Ron? Oh my god, what? You know, he kind of has a point. What? What do you mean? Well, if we hadn't done all those drugs, we might have actually graduated on time. Yeah. yeah, you might be right. You want to smoke a bowl? Yeah, meet you in Miss Ron's office. Cool, cool.